Well, a Greenville artist has reached international acclaim for a photo series that is now on display in Spartanburg. It celebrates children across the globe who are embracing their natural hair. 7 News' Jennifer Martin has more. At its best, art inspires us to be bold, courageous, and unique. That's why Greenville native Karen Bethencourt and her husband Regis got into photography in the first place. When we got into the industry, we noticed that there was a lack of diversity in the space. Um, and we also noticed that a lot of kids were um, covering up their own natural hair. So they started highlighting the beauty of natural hair in a photo series called Afro Art. It's not something that's seen as accepted. And so you have to, you know, either straighten your hair or do something different just to conform. The photos showcase children across the globe. We're showing how many different things you can do with it so that kids feel like, you know, it's something cool. It went viral after celebrities like Alicia Keys posted about it on social media, leading to national coverage on CBS, CNN, BBC, and Teen Vogue. The goal is to inspire the next generation to embrace their natural hair and themselves. Afterwards, a lot of them are usually excited, want to wear their hair styles home or to school. Afro art is now on display at the Upstate Gallery on Main in Spartanburg. We feel like this speaks to a different segment of the community that maybe we haven't reached out to in the past. The married duo says they hope viewers leave feeling empowered to embrace their roots. In Spartanburg, Jennifer Martin, 7 News. By the way, the duo's company is called Creative Soul Photography. You can meet them and some of the models tonight at the Upstate Gallery on Main in downtown Spartanburg between 5 and 8. The exhibition will be at the gallery through December 29th.